All right, hey you guys, it's your girl the Empress. And I'm coming to you on this lovely Saturday night. Y'all know I love love and the foundation of relationships um, is what molds our lives, right? Every relationship we've had has molded our lives. So, um, and I majored in psychology, minor in sociology, so all of that goes into my tarot. I don't know what, what other people are doing, but all of that goes into my tarot. That's why you relate so much. It's like spirit tells me what to say. But I, anyway, this is not what this is about. I don't know what spirit says, but this is why I see it. Yeah. Y'all, so let's see what's happening right now. That was a good spiel, okay? Somebody is releasing somebody, and somebody is like, Listen, don't you release me? Don't you don't release me? <laughs> Come on, spirit, what's going on? What's going on? Okay, Woo. two of cups here, unison, okay? Definitely, somebody want to build something, somebody wants a partnership. Um, somebody her partnership now somebody wants a marriage actually somebody really wants to connect what you're gonna do um the energy i'm feeling off this two of cups somebody is fiery with it they like what y'all gonna do like baby what what i mean woo. baby they are maybe take another sip of this wine i am i have been sipping the wine tonight i hope y'all have a magnificent night because i am hold on yeah, somebody want to come out of conflict, okay? Real talk. But you know what I'm hearing? I'm hearing this is a little spat that you all have. This is the first time y'all have come up. And I hear it first of many. This is a new relationship, okay? Or a, something, some trying to pop off. Something is trying to pop off. And... This person wants to come out of the dark with you. Like, they like, hold up now. It's, this is too much at this point in time for me. Okay? Like, okay. What you got to say? Yeah. Yeah. This person is very worried that you have released them. Okay? This person don't want to be released. This person does not want to be released from your energy, period. Like, I, they want to move past this moment in time. Or maybe you want to move past this moment in time. Yeah, yeah, they don't feel like you're giving them any direction right now. Like, you, you, you cold, stone cold silent. Okay, they feel like you haven't given them any direction, any inclinations. You haven't given this person anything. Okay, this person is like, yeah, they spying on you. Somebody looking at somebody somewhere. They know what you're doing. I don't know why they want me to read the signs on this card, but this card says Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I'm not lying. You can see it. You can see it. And then we have Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We also have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay? That's all that's on the board right now. That's all that's on the board right now. We have air and fire and water. Ten of Pentacles. Now we got the Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, and then we got Earth signs. Like, somebody wants to build a legacy with you, and they're just finding out about this. I, I, I keep it real. Keep it real. I feel like somebody was dating, okay? I feel like somebody was dating and somebody wasn't. I feel like somebody kept it real that they were dating and somebody didn't keep it real that they were dating. You feel me? And I feel like that played a part in this, this, this here. Now it looks like somebody was lying or... Now it looks like somebody has to make other people their option even they don't even though they don't want to because somebody is dating and, and they weren't expecting that person to date. That person want 
that they weren't spitting the truth out the way that you were spitting the truth out. Let's keep it real here. Let's keep it real here. We ain't playing them games. Hold on. Sip of the wine on this because this is going crazy right now. This is bananas, okay? This is bananas. All right? So now we have somebody that's having lack of direction and delays or delaying this this partnership because it, it really is both of y'all. I'm going to be real with y'all because I see the queen of swords and you ready to go off on them. Okay? But really y'all weren't together and you ready to go off. So you got to contain yourself. you like, let me cloak my energy right now because I need to be a divine feminine at all times. You trying to be divine around here. But the situation is really testing you is what I'm hearing. What is this? Yeah, because you feel like, okay, I'm overly emotional about this and, and everything. Right now, I need to take it easy, okay? Because it's like I'm in the, I'm in the itchy mode. Itchy mode. Okay, that's what I mean. But I'm trying to contain myself because I ain't even got, you know, really, I don't have authority or rights but it kind of hurt that you found out that somebody was dating somebody else because you you felt like there was a connection in this person did too they knew the chemistry was there I don't know whether this person was trying to just because they had been in something else that was so long that hadn't worked out and they were hurt about it and they just F it, I'm just going to date. And I ain't even trying to get close to nobody. And boom, it happened. The chemistry was undeniable here. Y'all both stuck on each other. Real tall. Y'all both want to gain a new perspective on what's going on with y'all. Y'all both want to talk about it. Y'all both want, I mean, I'm not opposed to that. Because let me tell y'all something. Two people that want to make something work out. It's one life to live. Be happy. And if you have dated and other people are not up to par, but this person is, I, I don't, I'm not opposed to that. Because you have to think with your higher self. Okay, you can't worry about other people and what they're going to think, okay? Somebody, people met people and, and married them in three months. And um, they're married, been married for 45 years. Not to say they didn't have issues, but if that's what they want to do, what is the problem with that? Like, people want to be happy. You know what I'm saying? And somebody, when they know something is enough, they're going to say enough is enough, you know, and you can't judge anybody for the decisions that they make. Like, I'm so pro-choice, you know, in everything in life. Because God said first, you have a choice, free will. Who is man or woman or anybody else to take your free will? Who are they? Who? who? Who are they? So I, you know, I'm not opposed to nobody because I feel like it's love on this. I just feel like there was some misunderstandings and, you know, both of y'all didn't really know how to date no way. I'm just, don't, don't get mad at me. That's what Spirit said. Both of y'all are used to dealing with sucky people. So y'all not used to dating. And then y'all bump into each other in this chemistry like this right here. Y'all like, wait a minute. Why is this going so fast, Spirit? I don't want it. But you do want it. I want to invest. I, there is nothing wrong. I mean, I don't know. Let me get out of my Spirit, what's the advice? The area before this ends. Okay. Oh. I must have been right. Step out there and take the leap of faith. Period. Life is a gamble. And if you don't gamble on yourself, who you gonna gamble on? I know I'm gambling. I'm doubling down on me. What's up? Y'all have a good day.